how, how, what advice could you give to people that would let them know how and when they should hit the reset button? I'll start with, I, I will get to the how. I'm going to start with this though. Um, if you are aware that you are unhappy, kudos to you. That means you're aware. That means something deep down, as you call it soul, intuition, gut, instinct is telling you you're not happy. You've got to listen to that because this is much stronger than this always. So listen to that. So kudos to you. So for those of you listening, Tommy was touching on his heart yeah, and yeah, chest. Uh, yeah, yeah, I was. Sorry. Versus, versus his head. <laughs> I talk with my hands too, so forgive me. <laughs> um, so kudos for you for being aware of that. Here's the tough part is you got to take action. Um, but I want to talk about one more thing is... Let me be very clear, the, the wonderful people filming this, yourself, my, me, we're all afraid, we're all scared, you're not alone in your insecurities, your fears, what's, you're not alone. I want you to know, I want your audience, I want me to know that you're not alone and we all wonder what if they figure out if we don't know, they don't know, if they know I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, <laughs> we yeah. all have that fear, right? Yeah, like that imposter syndrome. Yeah, all of us have that, yeah. but all of us have that secu- insecurities too of some degree of am I good enough? All of us. So I want your audience to also know you're not alone in that. And that's such a, a relief knowing that, hey, I'm not the only one who feels this because we put on all this exterior nonsense. We really do. The third thing, and this is the most difficult, is, is it, when, once you know you're not alone and you can lighten up on yourself and you know our self-critic is harsh, right? If we can start lightening up on that, that the next step is take action. And I would take action by, do baby steps or you can do massive change. You know, it's, it's totally up to you, but baby steps is okay. But start working on your mental and emotional state today. And that will pay dividends for you in your career, your relationships, your life. And I have many tools and tips for the mental and emotional state. It starts with, you can start a meditation practice. You could start with a gratitude practice. Gratitude works here and here and gets you in the present moment. So many of us don't have a gratitude practice. It could be in the shower, it could be in the car, it could be writing down. The toughest part is tell somebody you really care about how grateful you are. What that does is put you in a space of present moment. 